So the idea of showing this cat is if you have this. I, I have a cat here for you, by the oh, way. A cat. Right? So I get this cat and I put it in a box and I have a, a, a radioactive nucleus in the box. And if it decays, it, the, 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 the nice way to say it is it releases a sleeping potion. But in its original form, it releases poison. Uh, and so if it decays, it releases some poison, which kills the cat uh, or puts it to sleep. And it could wake up again at some point, depending on how sensitive you are. So it's either dead or it's not, depending on whether this thing decays or not. There's a probabilistic prediction for, the, for, for whether this thing has decayed or not. In just pure quantum mechanics, the nucleus is what's called in a linear superposition of states. So it's, it's, it's sort of some probability of being decayed plus some probability of being not decayed. And, and that's how you describe the, the nucleus. So that would suggest that's how you describe the cat. So the question is, is the correct description of this cat uh, both alive and dead with some different probabilities that can change over time?